नमस्कार आई एम कृषिका गुप्ता फ्रॉम क्लास सेवन डी ऑफ केम्ब्रिज कोट हाई स्कूल टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू प्रेजेंट अ वर्चुअल टूर ऑन द टॉपिक द एमेजन बेसिन सो फर्स्ट द एमेजॉन बेसिन दिस इज अ मैप ऑफ द एमेजॉन बेसिन this region lies very close to the equator that is 10 degree north and 10 degree south that is why it is known as the equatorial region the amazon river flows through here and there are many tributaries that join the amazon river this forms the amazon basin this basin also drains some portions of brazil parts of peru bolivia Ecuador, Colombia and a small part of Venezuela. Climate of the Amazon basin. So as the Amazon basin is directly on the equator, so it has very hot and wet climate. Both the days and nights are very hot and humid and the skin feels sticky there. The rain is almost every day and the day temperatures are very high with high humidity but the night temperatures are little less but with high humidity now the type of vegetation here as it rains very heavily in this region so there are much thick forest and they are so thick that they the leaves form a roof like structure and their branches do not allow the sunlight to reach the ground so the ground remains dark and only shade tolerant vegetation grow here the rainforest is rich in fauna birds like tokens as you can see in this picture hummingbirds birds of paradise they are found here they make loud noises in the forest animals like monkeys and tapping tapirs this is a tapir in the picture they are found here and many reptiles like snakes crocodiles are found here and anaconda and boa constrictor are some of the species and there are also many fishes including the flesh eating piranha this is found this fish is fa- found in the river so this basin is ha- has an extraordinary rich variety of life now the life of people in these rainforests the people grow their food in small areas after clearing some trees in the forest the men hunt and fish along the river and women take care of the crops they mainly grow tapioca pineapple and sweet potato as the hunting and fishing are uncertain so the women are the one who keep their families alive by feeding them they practice slash and burn agriculture their staple food is manioc that is also known as cassava it grows under the ground like potato they also eat queen ants and eggs and cash crops like coffee maize and cocoa are also grown here the rainforest provide them a lot of wood for the houses so some families live in thatched houses shaped like bee hives and there are other large apartment like houses called meloka with steep slanting roof development activities in this region the life of the people of the amazon basin is slowly changing in the older days the forest could only be reached by navigating through the river but in 1970 the trans amazon highway made all parts of the rainforest accessible aircraft and helicopters are also used for reaching various places and the indigenous population it was pushed out from the area and forced to settle in new areas there also they continue to practice their distinctive way of farming the slash and burn way 
the development activities are leading to gradual destruction the biologically diverse rainforest and it is estimated that a large part of the rainforest had been disappearing annually in the amazon basin the top soil is washed away as it rains and the lush green forest turns into a barren landscape thank you